Hello everyone, welcome back to Hotline Topics. These are all the things you never knew about the beautiful actress Lisa Silva. One of the defining qualities of this Nollywood actress is her beauty. This quality has not only propelled her into the hearts of fans across the globe, but has also seen her join the growing line of gorgeous actresses having a professional niche for themselves in the Nigerian movie industry. Elizabeth Omomi Tekovi Da Silva, popularly known as Liz Da Silva, is a Nigerian actress and producer. Liz Da Silva has shown her versatility and passion in her work that has shown that no matter the age you start, you will be recognized as a talent. Let's talk about Liz Da Silva's age. Liz Da Silva was born in 1978. She's 41 years old as of 2019. Liz was born and raised in Obalinde in Lagos, Nigeria. She, however, attended Pelade Nigerian Primary School in Oworo Shoki, Lagos. She used to wear glasses back then. Liz Da Silva's career. She started acting in 2004 after she was introduced by the actress Iyabo Ojo. She features in Yoruba indigenous movies. She was inspired into the theatre world from her secondary school days when she was involved in the school drama. Then she used to be the group leader and she got inspired from there. In 2012, she released her home movie titled Mama Insurance. The movie had an all-female cast such as Ayomogaji, Larry Hazan, Iyabo Ojo, Ronke Ojo and Doris Simeon among others. Liz has acted in a number of films. Some of her movies are Yetunde, Iyawu Babami, Aimo, Ogbo, and Alamba, just to mention a few. Lisa Silva's family. Lisa Silva's parents were separated and she grew up with her mother, who was a single mother. Her mother died before she began acting. Speaking about her father in an interview, she said, I know where he is, but the father-daughter relationship does not exist and i'm not bothered about that she further stated that you care for those who care for you growing up with my mother was very challenging and difficult i will always miss her she really stood by me all the while i feel sad i didn't do enough for her before she died her father eventually married another woman typically for men they tend to move on quickly for anyone to be a single mother it means the father of your child has another wife somewhere that is making him stay away from you Liz affirmed that she doesn't feel bad that the father has another wife i'm not used to him she said i don't think about him he's certainly not as close to me as my mother that was why i almost went mad when she died we were quite close to each other Liz silver son the actress is blessed with a child and he's a very cute baby boy, Abdurraham, Liz Da Silva's husband. Who is Liz Da Silva's husband? She's not married, but she has a baby father. The identity and news of her baby father was filled with controversies. Her left baby father was Yemi Olaoye, a short time before the baby was christened. Liz changed her name to Aisha Olaoye, reason being that the man she thought was her baby father is a Muslim, and before the baby gets a name, the mother must be converted. It was reported that Yemi Laoye turned out not to be the father, so the actress has since apologized to the man, and they both went their separate ways. Recently, Liz revealed that she's not married, but that does not mean that she's single. For now, she's keeping the man in her life and her relationship private. So what else does Liz do, apart from acting? She's into clothing and fashion. She deals with Ankara fabrics. Ankara materials like Ankara, Adire, Ashoke, and so on. She sells them and also designs them. She shuttles between Lagos and the neighboring West African countries where she also do business. She also travels abroad to market her products on demand. The actress unveiled her home fashion store in Lagos where she makes and sells lovely fabrics. She also opened a store at Radiant Plaza in Omalefe to Lagos where she deals in lingerie and male underwear. How does she cope with doing this business and shuttling between Lagos and West Coast and movie locations? Well, now you can understand or appreciate why she must not be in all movies. She tries to do all that because of the money. In her words, once I am invited for a movie job, I try to work out my schedule to fit into the program of the producers. Do I have a couple of persons helping me out in my clothing business? So when I'm free from movie jobs, I join them. And once I'm on location, they continue the job. So how does she combine all this with her family? For our family is family, business is business. None should affect the other because you need money from your business to take care of your family. It is always important to work out things to avoid the clash of interests. So who is Lisa Silva's role model in the industry? Her role model is a beautiful veteran actress, Bookie Wright. How does she wait off male fans who make advances at her? She said, in this profession, you just cannot run away from the fact that loads of admirers want to convert their admiration into something similar to love. They are both different, and you must know this as an adult and as a professional, so you must endeavor to draw a thick line between both. The question you must ask yourself is, how many lovers would I have if I listen to them or, or take them seriously? So it is only natural that you politely tell them 
Thanks for the interest in me, but sorry I cannot help you. What is Liz Da Silva's greatest challenge in acting? For her, it is trying to meet up with the standard of the character whose role she is playing. She could be asked to play the role of a mad, mad woman, a widow, or a prostitute. These are all different characters with unique identities which require special traits. So, doing her best to fit into that role and satisfying her producers, directors, and of course, her teaming fans out there is always a challenge to her. She tries to give her best all the time. What inspires her movie productions? Writing her script, she gets inspired by things that happen around her. And that is how she has been writing her script since 2008. Let's talk about Lisa Silva's Ankara or Africulture Day. Lisa Silva runs an annual event which has always featured different big celebrities. In an interview, she had this to say about the annual, annual event. The concept behind Ankara Day is to promote the unity of Africans through our culture, also to assist the less privileged through donations made on Ankara Day or Africulture Day yearly to organize fashion pageants for developing youth's positive behaviors towards cultural costumes to elevate and appreciate culture through our way of life, e.g. our mode of dressings to keep our bond as actors. The program for the event include choreography, stage plays, AOE, fashion parade, dance troupe, and musical performances. Elizabeth Omaomi Tekovi da Silva, aka Liz da Silva, has revealed that she can act nude in a movie if she is paid the sum of 1 billion naira. Lisa Silva made a revelation in an interview when she was asked questions on her pet project, the Ankara Day. In her words, I can do anything in acting. There is no limit to what I can do on stage as an actress because I'm a professional actress and I don't care because that role I'm playing is touching somebody somewhere. If you give me a new role that has something to teach people and does not affect any culture and tradition, I will do it. That is why I'm an actress. I don't care what people might see or think about me, she said. According to her, her husband would never mind if she acted nude. I'm sure my husband would be happy about it if he confirmed my account is loaded. People should be criticizing me while I keep spending the 1 billion naira largest from the role she had it. What would she advise your coming acts to do to make it in the industry? For her, she would say that if you want to be successful in whatever that you're doing, you should put God first and do your best. Be obedient, listen to people, positive advice, and the sky will be your limits. These are all the things that she did in secret to get to where she is today. See Liz that Silva's cute son, Momoriolua Abefemi. Thank you for staying with us until this time. We have come to the end of this episode on Liz Da Silva. I will hope you enjoyed it as well as learned a lot about this beautiful actress. Until next time, remain blessed.